My advice for current CAC challengers would be to not be afraid to make mistakes. Everyone can get frustrated once in a while when running into an error that seems impossible to debug, but it is good to view these mistakes as a learning experience that will make you into an even better coder. And you should be proud of all the great progress that you have made along the way. It's all offer to students who are participating in the Congressional App Challenge is to remember that above all else, it's a learning experience. And so as long as you do your best and as long as you produce something, it wasn't a waste of time even if you didn't win anything because the experiences and, the, and what you learned from that very experience, you can carry that over with the next application that you build. And so regardless of what the results are, you'll have gained something as long as you put in your all and to produce something as best as you can with the current skill level and, and with the resources that you have. And my advice to any current Congressional App Challenge participants would be to find a problem that's affecting either you or your community and then brainstorm ideas on how to fix that problem with technology. As for advice for our current CSE challengers, take a shot, put a team together, brainstorm some ideas that could be useful for your lives and just see what you could do. You'll be surprised by how much you can do when you set your mind to it or how much you can learn when you strive to improve each day. I mean, tech is the future. I'd love to see some amazing apps next year. Best of luck. And one piece of advice I have for all current Congressional App Challengers is to be creative, trust yourself, and don't be afraid to ask for help. I give a one piece of advice to students who are participating in the challenge this year, or you know, thinking of applying. What I would definitely say is to work on a team and to really kind of go outside of your comfort zone. So personally, you know, for me, when I when I applied in 2018, I had made a lot of apps before, I'd made a lot of websites, but I had never worked on a team. I'd certainly never worked on a team with four people who I didn't really know. And that, I have to say, it was a really good experience. I learned the importance of uh, diversity and perspectives when you're trying to come up with an idea. You know, maybe you think something's good, but someone else has a you know a life experience where they, they think, you know, maybe we should do this a little bit differently. You can have really interesting conversations and ultimately you get a much better product. So I would definitely say, you know, if you're on the fence, you're not sure if you want to participate, form a team, form a team of people you don't even know and see what you can create. It's going to be a really good experience. Hope that helped and uh, good luck this year.